right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Viewers and subscribers, Wagwa. Zion here coming at you again with another tutorial. And this time, Zion is under attack. So let's get to it real fast. One subscriber said, it's nice that I'm, you know, doing a lot of tutorials on the king of reggae. But also, what about the crown prince? Which I agree with. Another said, they want some Peter Tosh. Some say, Bonnie Wheeler. And of course, you know that Bob Marley, Peter Tosh and Bonnie Wheeler were the original wheelers. And also, there are a lot of other artists that contributed to reggae music and its growth that I've been skipping. So yeah, I've been messing up. I can admit to that. Your wish is my command. But before I go any further, if you have not yet subscribed to my channel, don't wait no longer. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button right down there. Hit the notification bell and hit all so whenever I post a new video or whenever I post a video, you'll be first to know, you will be alerted. So we're switching things up. Let's start with Revolution from the Crown Prince of Reggae, Mr. Dennis Brown. Grab your guitars. Let's go. All right, zoom on in. Now guys, as usual, let me start with this. I do not have anything on my guitar. No effects whatsoever. Right? My wah pedal is always ready just in case I want to do a little fancy something. Fancy something, you know what I mean? But for this song, it's clean. Alright? Now this song is a very, very, very simple song. You know, Dennis Brown have a lot, a lot of very good songs, some really big songs, you know what I mean? And I'm going to be doing a couple of those. And also I'm going to be doing some Peter Tosh and some Bonnie Wheeler, alright? So you guys just hang tight, alright? So, um, this song is in, basically, let's, it's an E minor to an A minor. My bad. E minor to A minor. Alright? I do not think it has... Uh, a stock line to it, but I'm gonna add some because I know I, I, I realize that people really like when I you know teach a stock lines, you know. And also, once you learn stock lines, you basically know the bass, you know, the bass part of the song. So, um, yeah, to get this E minor, you want to bar seven fret, place that middle finger on the second string, eight fret, pinky finger on the third string, nine fret, ring finger on. The fourth string, ninth fret. So it's a right. But we're not going to be using the E minor. We're going to be using the E minor seventh. All right. To get the E minor seventh, just lift the pinky finger. All right. Now. To get the A minor bar the 5th fret, place the ring finger on the 5th string 7th fret, pinky finger, 4th string 7th fret, alright? So you got, you're not going to be using the A minor, and I do it this way because, you know, I want to get you to know the position. You're going to lift the pinky finger. To have a revolution Or you can play E minor Do you know what it means to A minor? Yeah. But when you get to the chorus you go E minor 7 Da da Whoa A minor 7 Alright so that's you sweetening it You know sweetening the song Adding a little bit of sugar here and there So the first can be the straight E minor and the um, e minor to A minor and then the chorus goes E minor 7 just by lifting the pinky finger to the A minor 7 trust me that makes the song sound really good alright so that's basically what you're playing do you know what it means to have, have a revolution 
and what it takes to make a solution fighting against oppression and i'm playing it like this because i want you guys to hear it by tearing down the pressure chorus Da-da, hear that sound? Whoa, da whoa, da whoa. And so the strumming. Da da, whoa, da da, whoa. So, so for the strumming, real simple, basic strumming, one strike, remember, you got to be muting also, all right? And if you're playing with a full band, a bass is there, concentrate mostly on the thinner strings, you know? You know, you don't want to be... It's not going to sound too good, alright? So... Thinner strings. And while you strike, remember to squeeze. And release. Alright? And keep the fingers there just for it to, you know, to mute it. And every now and then, you can add a little bit of... You know, every now and then you put a little bit of that in the song, not too much. All right. There's one thing I like about Dennis Brown's songs. It's simple. They're simple and effective. You know, not too much instrument, so you can, you know, it, it, the song can breathe. The singer can get to really do his thing or her thing. So um, yeah, and that's basically it for the strumming. All right. So here comes everybody's favorite part, stock line. <laughs> now stock line is a guitar line that accompanies the bass that accompanies the bass line but plays in a higher register you know unmuted so to play a stock line you also want to have the, the hand rest right here so you can feel the strings under the palm right here so you will feel it all right so it's like made a little mistake there but that's basically that's it you know so you want to start here i'm gonna play it slow and you guys follow so it's like this on the e play it again so it's Stop at the E, then you jump to the A. Bap. All right, so you gotta feel it. You know, those little stuff you can add. So, you know, some doubling it up a little bit and all. So, yeah, that's basically it for the stock line. So, you can jump out, you can stop striking. You know? And go to... You know, and start following the bass. Or if you have two guitarists in the band or whatever, one can keep striking and one can play the stock line. That's it. All right, so there you go. My first Dennis Brown tutorial in a long while. 
Yeah, I already got one, so go ahead and check the channel. On that note, I have a lot of people asking me to do tutorials on, you know, songs that I've already done. Which means you guys have not been checking the channel. I implore that you watch the entire videos. Sometimes I have stuff at the very beginning, in the middle, or at the end. Things that you really do not want to miss out on. So in order for you to learn properly, watch the entire videos. And as usual, if you have not yet subscribed to the channel, do so now. Hit the notification bell also. Hit all. Turn that on so whenever I post a new video or a tutorial, whenever, you will be alerted. Give thanks for all the support. Blessed love. Peace out. See you next time.